and another crotal, and then you have gravelia. You see those tall ones are gravelia. So that's a gravelia line, line taking an octagonal shape around the house. So they are going like that, like that. Like. So as we go, we we'll see different tree lines. So what did we do? What, how does this uh, system work? It's called an extensive system. So you have 20 by 5 meters wide plots like this. Yeah. So in each plot we have banana, we have uh, oranges, and then we have mangoes. You yeah. see oranges and mangoes and pineapple, right? Mm. So those are the primary crops. So in between, we usually plant these giant beans in between for nitrogen fixing and ground cover. And then around each plot, yeah, around each plot, we have napier grass and lemon grass as an edge. The lemon apple. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it means, it means that even if you have limited resources, yeah, you can start by putting natural edge, which is affordable like napier grass, and then it will help you to regenerate your, your land. Yeah. And so as much as it is very hot, but you can see these plants are healthy and good, even the flowers. No, no flowers. Akondani, for your signboards. Oh, no, they are healthy. Yes. Yes, despite the heat and everything, because the environment is cooler. And nobody waters. Since we started planting here, nobody has ever watered. Yeah? So any question? So now using this design, we have about 300 plots like this. Yeah? Around this place. There are about 300 units which are like this. Yeah? So it means that when you start to develop your place, eh? if you want to put an extensive design, you can start, like that one is intensive, you can make another intensive unit, isn't you? Like that, like that, like that. Even this extensive unit, extensive unit, it's very small, it's not like this, it's very small. So, if you have a plot of 20 by 5 meters, it's very small, 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 moja